Alma, hello Lenny and hello Woof Woof. And what are we investigating today? Wow, this little flower is so sunny. It is really like the yellow of an egg yolk. It is just gorgeous. Okay, Alma, I know you know its name. Right, so this is bird's foot trefoil. Mmm, that's an interesting name. Okay, Lenny, tell us your fact. Right, so Lenny is telling me a bit of a story. When he was a child in Ireland, he would pick this flower and put it in his pocket and take it to school because they believed that this flower would offer them protection from their teachers. Whoa, Lenny, you must have had really scary teachers. Okay, Woof Woof, I'm coming down to you. Oh, right, Woof Woof has uh, quite surprised me. I didn't know he was a budding poet. So what he's done, he's taken all the unusual or common names for this flower and made them into a bit of a poem. All right, let's hear it. Tom Thumb, fingers and thumb, bellies and bums, or even granny's toenails. Eggs and bacon, bacon and eggs, cockies and hennies, I'm scratching my head. Fisherman's basket, horse yackle, pig toes. Bird's foot, deer vetch, my brain will explode. Cuckoo stockings, Dutchman's clogs, ladies slippers. This is getting to be a bit of a slog. This little bright flower with silly billy names. We've had a giggle. But let me explain. Bird's foot trefoil is a friend to the bee. Caterpillars munch it. And it is a delight for us to see. Wow, woof woof, that was marvellous. You have quite surprised me. Well, thank you so much, wildflower investigators. Until next time.